pretty sad that Agrarian Skies have disabled transfer notes. Oh, have they really? I had no idea. Oh well, I'm gonna have to learn a lot in this uh, live stream here. Let's fire the game up real quick. I haven't actually started it yet. It's uh. See, that's why it took me so long because I got spoiled by Sky Factory the last time around. Yeah, Sky Factory, you can grind it and uh, just get an early game transfer note and she's all sweet. Uh, but yeah, I think in this one it's got to be based a lot about. Uh, well, in some aspects it's more grindy, but in others you get a lot of bone meal at the start, so it doesn't take anywhere near as long to sort of get your tree farm going or anything like that. But we'll see how we go this morning. Uh, probably going to try and stream for about four hours today, but we'll see how we go. Depending on the internet. Also being able to uh, stream at 540p today, so we'll see how that manages to uh, end out. Let's put the other playlist on. Hopefully the audio levels are good. So yeah, you would have seen uh, <laughs> in the intro there the new follower notification. Um, so that's all looking snazzy. Here we go, game has fired up. Let's see if I've actually got it turned on. There we go, look at that, perfect. Ignis Extruder is the way to go? Yeah, I could imagine. Alright, so, for those that are watching on YouTube, welcome. Uh, we are live streaming. I don't have the chat on the, uh, the capture at all, but uh, hopefully you'll get a uh, <laughs> somewhat of a picture. I'll try and repeat all the questions or anything that gets uh, asked in the stream. I don't know how many parts this is going to end up being. Now let's see how we go. So, I guess we'll jump into the world here. Now, I think one of the problems with the latest versions of Agrarian Skies is you don't get the world downloads in the thing. And um, the way I had to get this, I had to get it off the uh, the forum thread. There's like a link to the Curse Forge um, download page thing. <laughs> you can get it from there. Um, so make sure you just get the previous version, Home Swing Home O. So, uh, uh, you actually think it's more grindy, at least the early game. It's very expensive, chop tree, make crook, get saplings, make dirt, sit over and over. Yeah, that's true, although, I think you don't have to wait for the trees to grow as much, which is good. So, uh, we'll see how we go. Jump into it here straight away. It's going to be interesting trying to uh, manage the um, hunger thing as well. Alright, don't need that for now. Let's get those. So, everyone should know that there is a dirt chest underneath here by now. I'm sure it's a well-known uh, easter egg of the map. So let's get this going. Music's still a bit loud? Alright, let me turn that down a bit. How's that? That should be a bit better. Thanks for the input, Crunchy. Welcome to the stream, bud. You're gonna enjoy it. Alright. Crafting table, it up. Or well, crafting station in this case. Let's get these crooks going. Pretty much every early game skyblock at the moment. Let me turn my sound up just a tad and on my headphones. <clears throat> Perfect. <laughs> it's good to hear. Hey, oh, look at that! A new follower. Thanks, Crunchy, for following, bud. But yeah, this is going to be uh, bringing back a few memories of the start of the Sky Factory now. <clears throat> it's going to grind this out. We're at the four saplings, which is good. It feels like the drop lights, drop, drop lights, drop rates for the saplings are a lot higher in this for some reason. But I might just be. Do you agree? Also, I'd recommend getting yourself a watering can as soon as possible. It makes the tree thing, grow thing. Yeah, without the bone meal, I definitely agree. Maybe we'll get to that at some stage here soon. <clears throat> so I think one of the first quests is to uh, get yourself um, a piece of wood, so we'll be able to hand that in pretty quickly here. It looks like it's becoming night time already, which is, uh, yeah, interesting. <laughs> oh, did we get, oh my god, did we get, oh no! <laughs> we got a big tree already. <clears throat> Well, that's not exactly what I'd like to, uh, get. <laughs> it's gonna make things a little tricky. 
guess we should get plenty of saplings off it, but still. Welcome to the jungle, New follower, thanks Hunter Coleman for following, bud. Much appreciated. Thanks for tuning into the stream. Glad to see that notifier is working well already. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess like I'm not getting much saplings off this tree for some reason. Hmm, well we might just have to leave it as is for now. So, we'll chop the rest of this down. <clears throat> I bet my walkie. Oh my gosh, a donation already, $5 from Unknown Aussie, you are the first donator to the stream. Thank you very much. I very much appreciated. That's the first donation I've ever got. That's crazy. Glad you're uh, enjoying it. You need to combine your pro CSGO and Minecraft skills and use them in Ace of Spades. Never heard of them. How long have I been live streaming? I've been live for about, well, the stream's been live for about 30 minutes, but I've only been playing for about five. Thank you very much for that donation. Crazy. All right. Well, I think we can probably turn our first quest in here. So if you look at your book... Oh, it's raining. It has been oh, turn the music off for this. Years. Code wizards meddled in the balance of nature and released hordes of monsters from other dimensions on an unsuspecting world. Not satisfied with just destroying the human life, the monsters rampaged across the world, eating everything they could find and leaving nothing in their wake but empty void. Welcome to the jungle, bitch! <laughs> They had just enough power to protect your home and a small amount of land from the final devastation. In return for their protection, you agreed to collect the materials and resources the creators would need to remake the world once the hordes retreated back to the Hell Realms. The Great Trio cast their spell to protect you, while the Magician Way of Flowing Time forced the evil armies into submission and ordered them back to their dimensions. Upon waking up, you find that the creators, the Jaded One, and the Cute One have left a small amount of supplies to get you started. They apologize for not being able to give you more. If you complete the tasks assigned, you will receive more rewards to help you in your mission. It is up to you to recreate the world, to provide a home for the poor lonely creatures left alone and homeless, to repopulate the planet. To this end, the Jaded One has compiled a list of the many items and fluids that will be needed. This book will magically update your progress as you complete quests and may at times have new quests added if she sees she missed a requirement. To start, punch tree, get wood. That's awesome. That is such a cool feature from this uh, pack. Um, also, I just got to check, I checked the uh, donation message. Looking forward to this series, smiley face. I am looking forward to it as well. Very much. Thanks again for that donation. All right, music is back going. <clears throat> so while it's raining here, oh, I don't want to jump too much here. Let's make ourselves three barrels because we're going to need them. Oh, am I going to have enough? Not quite. So let's plonk these down and start collecting some water. <clears throat> Ace of Spades, not a huge fan. Uh, it was a bad FPS that tried to mix Minecraft. I haven't played too much of it, to be completely honest. Um, jungle, thanks for following Spyword. Very much appreciated. Damn, answering on tablet takes ages. I could imagine it probably would. Alright, let's get this back across here. Alright. So, now we've got those going. They're going to collect water for us real quick while we're doing other stuff here. Um, but I think the first quest, like I was saying, is to get some wood here, so, manual submit, flame reward, alright, what's the next quest, so using the QDS, so this is another pretty straightforward one, so the quest delivery system is this block that I have in my inventory here, and I've just realised I don't have enough, let's put these down so we don't have to, uh, don't have to jump, alright, so, to use the QDS, you pretty much have to put a, uh, a hopper on the side, or something like that. Uh, and then you go into your quest book, and you go select task, like so. Then you right click on the block with the book, so then it's set to that uh, particular task. 
and then uh, whatever you got to feed in, you just put in the hopper, it'll feed her in, and then you look in the book, and then it says 100%, which is good. So no help given now. Just give the hopper back. You don't need to get, uh, you don't get to keep it. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, hang on. Was I supposed to get a pick or something? Um... How am I supposed to break that without a pickaxe? Whenever you try to tweet from your phone, it takes uh, makes you upset, especially with an awful tweeter. Very long-winded, yeah, I know. Anything on phone or anything like that is hard to do. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to get a... Uh... Oh, maybe not. You hey, follow a Hayden. 2104, thanks for following, buddy. Very much appreciated. I missed a reward? How did I miss it? Um, I don't know how that works. Oh, I think we're gonna have to make this. Can we even make a um? I think there's another quest if I go back. All right, let me have a look. Ah, there you go. Look at that using the book. Well, that's why I didn't get a pickaxe. <laughs> All right, that that works a bit better. Let's organize this a little bit better. You don't get a pick? Uh, it looks like I got one. <laughs> That's alright though. Sweet. Alright, so now I have to give this hopper back. Oh. Oh, manual submit. Should we go for the full heart? I think we're going to go the reward bag for now. Oh, you get both. That's right. So this is a, a full heart. That's good. Now apparently there's bad ones of these too, so... Gotta be careful. So I'll eat this. Ding! <laughs> alright. See what we get in our quest bag. A rain muffler. Well, that's all right, but we've already got one of those, I think. So, oh well. Let's put that down. Put that down here for now. So, what's the next quest? <clears throat> in the beginning. So it looks like we need to make all of our Tinker stuff. To start off with. So, but I think have I got any gravel? I think I'm going to use this gravel to make ourselves a bit of a uh, an axe for this tree. <clears throat> so. Am um, I going to have enough wood here? Probably. Probably not actually now that I look at it. Stencil table. Art builder. Let's go punch a few more of these down. Hopefully it's not too dark for you guys and you can still see what's going on. It should be fine I think. I got the darkness turned all the way up. Alright, that should be enough wood to keep going here. So, I'm gonna need the crafting table, and we're gonna need um, one more of those. <clears throat> Sorry if I, uh, my voice is a bit croaky at the moment. I've only been awake for about an hour, so that's probably why. Alright, tool station. So, that's all three of them. Let's put these down. And the stencil table, so for our axe we just need a tool rod pattern and an axe head. So pretty straightforward here. Use a stick for the handle and the flint for the axe. Now it's good that this has got iguana tweaks in it. I really like that mod. I haven't had too much to do with it in the past, but from what I've heard and what I have played with it, it's pretty fun, so Let's see if we can chop more of this tree down. So annoying that we got a <laughs> big one to start off with. Good for the leaves, but uh, I can't quite get up to the top just yet, so. Ooh. Don't like jumping on this uh, log too much. I don't know whether chat's frozen or if just no one's talked in a while. Can't quite tell. I'll let it go for another couple minutes just in case I'm just not picking it up. Alright. So, how much wood have we got? I think we're going to infest. Uh, I don't know whether we will actually because I've got all these here. We might have to 
grow a tree elsewhere in the map. Let's take this down a little bit here. Actually, our quest might be pretty close here. Yeah, we only need a chest, so let's just finish this quest off really quick. You like, usually like going from the top of those things, uh, top to bottom on those big ones. Yeah, I know, I just got no way of getting up to the top at the moment. The chat looks like it's still working. Chest is good, quest reward. I think we're gonna go with the Panda Destiny because we've already got ourselves an axe. So, uh, plenty of apples too, which is good. So this thing allows us to cook stuff, I'm pretty sure. You can put it on the ground and it'll cook stuff up. Um, let's see what we've got in this reward bag. A whole heap of bees that I've never had anything to do with before. That's fair enough. Maybe they're good bees. I don't really know. So, uh... <laughs> Alright, let's get the rest of this down, because uh, I really need it. Such a shame, those big trees are so annoying. <laughs> Just cleaning up here, making ourselves a little bit more space. So I think we're going to try and grab our sieve and stuff here pretty quickly. So we need to uh, infest the tree first to do that. So. At least this rain's been good to uh, collect in the barrels early on rather than having to wait for ages. I remember in the Sky Factory map, we had to wait so long to get our uh, first drops of water. Put this back down somewhere. Probably over here, I guess. Hmm. Alright, well. Let's just grow another one and see what we end up getting here. Come on. There we go. Now, I'll probably jump up to the top, even though I really don't want to. So that. I can separate these two. So that I can fess the bottom one without it going into the top one. Even though I didn't really want to jump there. See, we're already down half a, uh, a pork chop. It's not real good, but uh, get that. All right. So silkworms allow you to in, uh, invest the leaves. And you can see on the... Uh, oh, that's one thing. Probably should move that down. Now that I look at it. Um, oops, this way. How's that looking? That's a bit better. Now you can see it. Yeah, on the X hello. Uh, not the Hello, the um, Whaler, that's the word I'm looking for. You can see the progress of this, so we'll let this thing go. Uh, in the meantime, let's look at the next quest. Ah, so you need to make the sieve, the fishing rod, the wooden hammer, and the bed as well. So we'll work on that. So it looks like you get a stone axe. And you also get a quarter of a heart and then some seeds. I think we're going to go for the carrot seeds too. Just because you can get a lot of food out of that. And uh, that's going to be good. So, what's the librarian? Ask where the player needs specific items to do this. Uh, oh. So it looks like we need to make a book binder. What do you actually need for that? Oh, that's pretty straightforward, although you need paper. So we're going to have to sieve a fair few things. Alright, we're going to get the sieve and all that pretty quickly here. I could imagine once this in infests all of the trees. Should we go for a little bit of a look around the map? I think that's not a bad idea. Just in case there is any little extra easter eggs around here somewhere. Oh, I don't really want to climb this. No. There we go, that works. What's that over there? Is there a way up? Here we are. See, that's the thing, you gotta be really sneaky about how you climb up around the things. Praise the road, praise it now. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> Is there anything in here? It's all just stained clay. By the looks of it. Okay, well, it was worth a look anyway. So I want to expand this platform at some stage. I think I'm just going to end up digging off, uh, digging up most of this area in here, just so I can expand out a little bit. Oops. Dig a lot of this up and uh, move it all across. But yes, I can see this is very, very slow start. 
Hopefully we grind through it pretty quickly here. I'm thinking... One, two, three, four. I think I'll put a bit of wood here. Ah, dirt here, sorry. Grab another tree, so we're going to want to put at least three. That's a slab. Mm. Gotta be careful here. I'm not going to have that many blocks left over, but that'll be fine. Now that should work, I think. Alright, that should work just fine. Let's get another tree going. Growing here. Very nice, very nice. Let's separate these before they uh, infest each other because we're going to need enough stuff to make some more dirt. So I'm going to need a lot more leaves. I'm going about, just about to run out of this durability on this crook too. Yeah, I thought so. Can I have another one? Nope. Oops. Wow, this is a very uh, hard style song. I might skip it, I think. <laughs> so, just getting started here. Still on that grind. If you guys got any questions about anything, make sure you let me know in the, uh, in the chat. It's gone quiet here after that good start. Yo, what's going on, Fire Clam? Uh, not Fire Clam, Fire Clay Man. <laughs> Whoops. You browse the FTP subreddit on Reddit and they make me feel so bad about your building skills. Mate, they make me feel bad about my building skills too. Those guys, some of the people on there are just crazy good builders. They're just absolutely nuts. And like, even the Minecraft subreddit, some of the stuff they put on there is, like aesthetically, it's just wow. Just crazy nice to look at. So, I wouldn't feel too ashamed. Some of those guys have just got a natural uh, ability to make stuff look good. Oop. Yep. Gotta make sure we don't fall off the edge. <laughs> I think we only got like three lives or something. At the moment, anyway. Now, some of these are starting to get pretty close. We need, in total, we need 18 string. Now, hopefully, we'll get that from one tree. Fingers crossed we do, otherwise we're going to look a bit silly here, chopping all these ones down. <laughs> Alright, how are we looking here? So, if you look at them, at a, when they're at 100%, then they're good to go, so... Oh, there we go. Lucky I made a few more crooks. Now, I'm going to eat an apple here. Hopefully, that gets our saturation up a little bit. Now... For those that don't... Oh, that one might not have been at 100%. Whoops. Um, for those that don't know the food... That one wasn't 100% either. Ah, oh, I'm rushing things. <laughs> glad you actually caught the stream. I'm glad you're here too, buddy. Um, so the way that the food system works is... You've got your hunger down the bottom here, your um, lamb shanks. And then on top of that, uh, you have what is called saturation. Now, it's like an invisible bar you don't actually see. And different foods give different saturation values. Now, in normal vanilla Minecraft, it's not too much of an issue because food is just, there's so much of it. But in this, because uh, we are very limited and we don't get much from it, uh, the saturation plays a big key now. The saturation bar, when it runs out, that is when you start taking food, uh, when the food meter goes down. How am I? I am really good. I'm on holidays now from uni for the next month, which is awesome. So, uh... <laughs> Things can't get much better than this. Here, hanging out with you guys, playing some uh, agrarian skies. Things are good. How about yourself? Fire. How are things going with you? Still don't quite have enough. We need... We're close. We should get the rest of it from this, I think. And then we'll probably end up doing... We'll, we'll do this one anyway as well. Maybe that'll spread. Yes, it's already spreading. Good. Getting close. Oh, let's take a sip of that water. Oh, it's getting nighttime already. Hopefully, stuff doesn't start spawning. Black and yellow 
So you look at all this area is ready to have stuff spawn on it, so we have to be careful. Doing good. Also on summer summer break from school. That's good. Summer break is the best. Can't deny that. Oh, we're getting close. Ah, what happened to that one? It disappeared. Oh, these ones, they're pretty close. Oh, wait, wait. oh, we need three more. And then we, oh, I didn't want to sprint there by accident. And then we're going to want to make our bed pretty soon as well. Just so that we can sleep through the night and not risk anything spawning. Um, the aim of the game right now is cobble gen. We can nearly make the hammer right now. Let's do that. Mate as well, so... Hammer is... I need a bit more wood, so... Two sticks diagonally, and then you material that you want to make the hammer out of in the crafting station like so. Pretty straightforward. Oh yes, we got it. Sweet. So we can make our sieve. So you want to make yourself two silk mesh. Uh, we're gonna need some more wood. Like so, and that gets you your oak sieve. Now the way that this works, we'll do this inside so that we don't accidentally throw stuff off the edge. Um, but if you get your dirt and you chuck it in like so, you can sift it and you can see there is a, uh, a percentage of the way through at the top there. And you'll get, uh, wow, we got some pumpkin seeds. That is very handy. Is this like Sky Factory? This is very similar to Sky Factory. It's a skyblock map uh, and it's it's got a, a, a mod in it called Hardcore Questing Mode. And it gives you this book and it gives you a set of challenges to uh, do. So it gives you a little bit more of a, a structured approach to it. So I'm going to eat another apple here because I'm losing health. Uh, hunger. So how much stones have we got? We're getting good luck here. So I'm going to want to get... How many stones is it? We need three, I think. Might be a bit more. So we'll do this last bit of dirt. Whoa, we got some other seeds too. Jeez, we're getting some good luck here on the drop. It's harder, but it's still a skyblock. Jadicat is the maker of the mod that ties to make it have a progression system so you can uh, progress through it. Through ages, yeah, that's a good explanation, uh, spy word. All right, so we got that. Um, so what else did we need to get for this quest? Open up. Smooth as silk. So I need a fishing rod and a bed. So I have to get the rest of these uh, going here. I'm not getting much luck on the string here at the moment. There we go. Well, we can make our fishing rod at least, so let's do that. I think this is it. Yes. Wow, that is cool. Yeah, it's such a neat idea for a mod. There's a lot of skyblock sort of mods that came out a couple of months ago. Like Next Next Hill, I was for a skyblock and then uh, everything. One of the neat features of Next Hill, I think you can click uses and then you can go to sieving. Sifter? No. Next Hill, I sieve. And it gives you all of the chances of dropping different types of things. Mana beans, 2%. Jeez, you'd have to do a lot of dirt for that. So yeah, and you can then find all the recipes, so you can pretty much find anything you need to get and what you need to sift to get it. Wait, you can sift lava still? How does that work? <laughs> oh, you can sift it and it. Wow. Interesting. It's pretty great. You've been playing it in your spare time. You should check it out, Clayman. What launcher? It is on the FTB launcher. I should have a link for that, but I, uh, I don't, which is uh, probably not good. <laughs> Oh good, a 0% drop chance for an iron ore berry bush, that seems legit. <laughs> Ooh, that one probably wasn't 100%. I am just too eager guys, too eager. How many have we got? Oh, we need four more string and then we've got the bed. Well there's one. There's another. This one's close. One more. Ah, uh, uh, oh, dang it. <laughs> Close. This music is pretty chill. 
There we go. <laughs> Here we go. Fingers crossed this is the last string we'll need. Oh my god, an Enderman just teleported on the top of the tree. Did you guys just see that? Don't. Don't hurt me, Enderman. Pretty please. Now yeah, hopefully... Oh, leave again. Carrot seeds. Yes, I think we're gonna go carrot seeds for this. Please don't take them out of our inventory. Oh, and the first stone. Oh, we did the cobblestone bit anyway already, so that's good. Did we get everything? Oh, yes, we got to keep it. Awesome. So what's on this pick? Bane of arthropods. I guess that's like a spider killer. So, uh, let's sleep through the night because we can. <laughs> what country do I live in? I live in Australia. Um, yeah, that's where I am based. Alright, so, next thing we're going to want to do... Oh, my gosh. If I stand here, he can't get me, can he? Do you reckon we should just go for the Ender Pearl? What have we got on this thing? Five attack damage, three hearts. How many hearts has this guy got? Oh my! Oh, he's gonna attack me anyway. Well, it looks like we're gonna hit him. This could be bad, or it could be good. Either way, where is he? Oh, he's on the roof, I bet. I bet he's on the roof. Uh-oh. There he is, come at me. Bro, come at me. Well, we're in a bit of a predicament now. <laughs> I don't have any ranged weapons, and he is extremely loud. Downloading it now. Have fun, bro. It's, uh... Pretty grindy early stages, but uh, like, yes, three shot that enderman, and we got the ender pearl, so that's going to be very handy. Oh, stop yelling at me, enderman! <laughs> well, that's good. You have a related question: How do you deal with all of the evil animals that want to kill you in Australia? I mean, giant spiders, evil snakes—you couldn't do it. Well, yeah, it is uh, hectic times. I used to live on a farm when I was really long, really long, <laughs> when I was really young. And uh, we saw snakes pretty much on a daily occurrence. Starting backup server. I've never seen that before. Uh, in terms of spiders and stuff, they're pretty harmless. You just gotta not piss them off, really. <laughs> Alright, so at least we got those carrot seeds now. And uh, we got still got a bit of dirt, so I might plant these. Get them going here. So, uh, to do that, we need to get ourselves a, um, a hoe first, though. And I'm pretty sure the wooden hoe, you don't need to do it in Tinkers. Yes. Time to farm. That is indeed correct. So, we'll plant these things down. Where are they? Carrot seeds. The rest of them in here. And uh, we'll let that go for now. We can always just spend a whole heap of uh, bone meal on them at some stage if we need to uh, boost our food. But for now, we're alright, so... That one wasn't... Oh, that... Oh, i got to stop hitting them early. <laughs> that is the one thing. I'm so impatient. Alright, so we're looking pretty good for getting our... Um, our sieve here pretty soon. We're getting pretty lucky on these drops. How many, uh, got five silkworms, that's not too bad. Alright, so... What's the next quest? I'm pretty sure this ties in with one of these next quests. Dust in the wind. Uh, or is it be resourceful? Alright, so it's be resourceful. So what we need to do is get sand, cobblestone, gravel and dust. Now the way you do that is with our hammer that we made before. You can put your cobblestone down. And you hammer it, and you get gravel, pretty much. And then, if you go ahead and put your gravel down, and hammer that, you get sand, and then if you get sand, hammer that, you get dust. Now, I think you don't have to have each of them. Yes, good. So, rewards. We get another pick. Interesting. Uh, a full heart. Reward bag. I, I, don't, I think we're going to just get a reward bag, see what we get out of it. 
Oh, well, that gave us a few things. Nice. This song's sick. Um, reward bag, basic. Four slimy saplings, that's good because we'll get uh, some slime uh, balls out of that, which is good. So that's good, we already got a source of slime balls. Alright, half a heart, quarter of a heart. Let's... Actually, I think I've got another quarter of a heart upstairs. Yes, we do. So we get another full heart here. Full heart. I'll just leave that for now, because I don't think we necessarily need to add one just at the moment. Alright, well. Oh, now we're going to inf infest the top tree. <laughs> that was probably a fake heart anyway. Yeah, probably. Alright, so. What's the next? What's on this other pick that we just got? Thormic, stone bound, reinforce three, repair material, netherrack. Ooh. What's the repair material on that? Wood. Uh, okay, so that's why it's gonna be hard to uh, repair. That's fair enough. All right, so now that we've done that one, oh, that's the smeltery. We're not gonna get anywhere close to that. We might have to do this dust in the wind, maybe, or melting stone. We might try this. Yes. So. To get your, uh... Wait, you aren't adding the extra life? Daring? I think we've already got three hearts, though. So. Yeah, we already got three, so we're fine for the little while anyway. Shield buff. She'll be right. Alright, so, we need to get an unfired clay bucket and an unfired crucible. So, to do that, we need to get our dust, and this is where these barrels come in very handy. So, if you put them in, you end up getting clay. And I shouldn't have made this all the way around the back here. Oh well. Oof, that was sneaky. So yes, that was very handy to have <laughs> early on. Throwing caution to the wind, pretty much. Every time I start recording or live streaming, my nose goes so itchy. I just, just gotta stop playing with it. Alright, so then when you get your clay, what you can do is just put it down and then uh, dig it back up and you get your clay, so... That is how you get that. Now, to get your unfired crucible, uh, you want seven clay. With seven bone meal, you get porcelain clay. And you go ahead and do that. Now, you've got to actually fire this thing before you can use it. You know, that means we're going to have to get a furnace, which means we're going to have to get six cobblestone, which we don't really have. Um, but there's a way you can do that. Uh, the first thing, though, I'm going to make ourselves an unfired clay bucket as well while we're at it. So now if you look in the quest, we've done this bit, but you need to fire it, so you need to get a slab furnace. Which is why we need the six cobblestone. Now, how many saplings? We've got plenty, so... If you put eight saplings in a barrel, it'll compost for you. And that means it turns into dirt. So, that's good. Uh, but now we're running low on saplings, so I'm gonna have to make another one. Another tree here, I think. Am I uploading this stream to YouTube? It definitely will be. That's why I'm uh, playing Monster Cat music at the moment, so that I don't get a copyright strike <laughs> on the YouTube channel, which isn't good. I think I just took that out of my inventory and put it back in straight away then. That's pretty derpy. Uh, we want to get some shears pretty quickly too, because you can actually use leaf blocks in there to compost to get dirt. So, uh, yeah, that's a big thing. And then you also get apples and stuff, I think, from them as well, maybe. Sure. Yes, this whole stream will be on YouTube. I really need to add like a, a, a top donators thing to the stream, I think. You might have to leave soon. Yeah, I think a lot of people will be coming in and out of the stream. It's it's that's fine fair enough because it's a long time to sit here and watch a stream, pretty much. Alright, so Hatchet this down. We might do another one while we're at it, I think. Getting close to that cobble gen a lot quicker than what it took <laughs> when we did it with um, uh, Sky Factory, that's for sure. Just want to say that on a side note, the quality of your content for the size of your channel is great. You make good stuff, especially compared to others. Oh, thank you very much, Spyweird. Very much appreciate it. I always do try to make my, uh, my content as good as possible and as... Uh, clean and 
good quality anyway. A lot more professional than uh, just sitting down and recording, but not to say that that's not a bad way of doing it, but I just like to try and make stuff uh, as clean and high quality as possible. I'm glad you enjoy it, that's for sure. Um, there's been some pretty good channel growth over the last couple of weeks, uh, with starting at UHS 3. We've been gaining subscri subscribers like crazy, which is awesome. So, uh, hopefully now that I am, because I'm on holidays, I'll be able to stream more and uh, make more videos for you guys. I think I'm, I'm trying to do daily uploads now at the moment. It seems to be working alright, although it's not every episode, every day it's not going to be Minecraft because that's going to be hard to uh, do. Plus I like to play other games as well. And like the other day I think I uploaded Counter-Strike, which is uh, a bit different. Alright. So this dirt's done. Oh man, I'm gonna steal some of this really quick so I don't have to walk around there without the chance of falling off. Hello, there's. Let's get rid of that little block. Yo, what's going on, Minecraft dude? 922. Uh, 922. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How much dirt have we got? Three. We might need a little bit more, so let's... Oh, that dog next door is going crazy. I don't know whether you guys will be able to hear him or not. Mm. We need to sleep through the night. So let's go do that and sift the dirt that we've got. Oh. Come on, up the ramp. <laughs> UHS is the reason you subbed and you're glad you did. Ah, oh, I'm glad you uh, found that video. I think uh, I was one of the first people to actually make videos on UHS 3. I think I uploaded it the day it came out. A lot of fun. Very much a lot of fun. I dare say there'll be a few UHS 3 streams here before long too. Maybe even tomorrow, the day after. Who knows? Um, Alright, let's get this cobblestone going. How many did we end up getting? Oh, we're going to be close. Yes, six. That's what we like to see. All right, so we can get our slab furnace now. So, grab your slabs and then chuck them in like so. Awesome. It's like three quarters per dirt or something. Thanks for following Minecraft, dude. Uh, it's three or four per dirt. Sometimes you get lucky and get a whole piece out of dirt. Yeah. Yeah, I think that, like the chances are... Oh, I don't have any dirt anymore. Oh, we could have looked it up, but yeah. Nine people in the stream, guys. If you are new and you want to be like Minecraft, dude, you can click that follow button and you'll get notified whenever I go live or whatever. And you get that awesome notification uh, up over there. <laughs> um, all right, so the first thing we're going to want to do is make ourselves a bit of charcoal. Now, the reason for this is... Uh, all right, I think there's... Uh, See, there you go. So, oh, that's interesting. I don't know how exactly that, it says like 1.3334 required. Not exactly sure what that means. But you can see how many, uh, how much it's worth when you use it. Oh, okay. I'm a little bit confused. <laughs> don't worry, I can't explain that too well. Yes, you did upload it the other day, it came out. I was looking for vids that. Uh, that day yours showed up. Such an intense follower notification. <laughs> well, at least, at least it gets my attention anyway. Always the wrong way to the left. Yep. Classic. Alright, let's get three of those going. Some charcoal. And then we'll smelt up our unfired crucible. Uh. Yeah, no, my brother suggested uh, that we use that as the follower notification. I thought, well, not a bad idea. <laughs> Definitely gets your, uh, your racing anyway. Alright, so let's chuck... Let's clean our inventory up a little bit here. we got a whole heap of junk. Alright, so... Let's fire our crucible real quick. And we'll do our bucket as well. Oop, and chuck that in there as well, and then put five wood in there just to get some more charcoal when this is done. Alright, so the clay bucket, how this works, it's similar to um, 
It's not similar to anything. What it does is, like a normal bucket, you can move water around in it, but if you move lava, it, it breaks when you put the lava down. Uh, so you get one use out of it like that. So I think we're going to try and make an infinite water source here. Um, to start off with. Where am I going to put it though? That's the question. Should I put it inside here? I'm thinking we'll put it inside here. Alright. So I'm pretty sure there's a water source. Oh. We have to be quick here about this, otherwise, um. Oh no, there's a water source up top. That's for sure. That's right. Oh, navigate away around. Yeah, there's a water source already here, I'm pretty sure, so. Yeah. Let's make another one. This music is so calm and like just chill as. This uh, the combination of the last two Monster Cat uh, album releases. So I think it's like 017 and 016. Ascension and can't quite remember what the other one is. Hopefully, oh, I need to eat. We need to get food here soon. <laughs> but uh, we got those carrots growing, so. All right, so water source is good. Now, the thing is, we need to get a piece of charcoal so we can make ourselves some torches. Which I don't have any sticks for. And the way that the crucible works... Let's just put it here for now. Oh god, that could have been bad. Alright, let's, uh, let's fix that. <laughs> so, you put your crucible down over a, t a heat source. Now... Obviously a torch is not going to be a very good heat source, normally you'd want like fire or something under there. Um, you can see that if you look at the uh, whaler tooltip, it's going to make one millibucket per tick uh, when you add stuff in here. And you need four cobblestone in the crucible to make one bucket of lava. For some, we some weird reason, I keep on spawning in the void. Ah, because you need to download the map as well. Um, the way, I think with the latest version of the pack, there's no map included, and the, when you download it off the launcher itself, it doesn't uh, include it properly. Yeah, I tried the, uh, downloading it spyweb, and uh, it doesn't install the map properly, so if you go to the, um, uh, the Feed of the Beast forum and look up the Agrarian Skies thread, there's a link to the uh, Curse Forge website where you can download the map itself. Um, Alright, so we need to get four cobblestone here. And I've got none at the moment, so we're going to need to get some more dirt going. Look at all that. I want to go get all that, but uh, we just can't quite get there at the moment. Uh, you believe starving this pack equals instant death, so be careful. You don't have time to fix it later. <laughs> yeah, I know. I've got five apples. She'll be right for now. All right, let's grow a few more trees here. What does it take to get a watering can? These days, it might be... Oh, no, it's no different. Hopefully the uh, quality of the stream's decent. I've, I've upped the bitrate and uh, changed it to 540p today compared to normally when I'm only streaming at like 430 odd. And it seems to be handling it alright. I think uh, my internet gets very congested at night time here in where I live and uh, it slows down a lot. That's why I can't really stream at night time too much for me. Alright, let's get one more tree here. Oh no, was it another big one? God dang. What is it with our luck in big trees at the moment, guys? <laughs> ay, ay, ay. The quality is very nice, especially telling that it works for me because my internet isn't so hot. That's the thing, because I don't have the, um... The, uh, what's it called on Twitch? Oh my gosh, I should know this. Um, oh, they're infesting these leaves already. Ah, uh, the transcoder. That's the name I'm looking for. That like You can select the quality of my stream. I don't have that yet because I haven't had enough concurrent viewers at one time. So uh, I do tend to stream at sort of a low bit rate so everyone can watch so people don't miss out. 
Plus the fact my internet can't really handle <laughs> high bit rates at the moment anyway. Not not on super crash hot internet compared to say like America or Sweden or anything like that. My upload speed is considerably low. What time is it for me? It is 10.30? 10.50 in the morning. 10.50 a.m. So nearly an hour in already to the stream. They're not making bad progress, I don't think, for an hour. Getting plenty of string out of this tree. We're going to have to get up there and get that thing somehow at some stage. Almost 8 for you guys. Almost 9 p.m. for Minecraft. Dude, I'd imagine most of you guys would be from America. Because that's uh, pretty much that time over there, I think. Alright, let's, let's clean the inventory up. we got a lot of junk in here. Uh, plenty of silkworms. We can actually cook those up and eat them, and they have a lot of saturation. So, you know what? We might actually do that here in a second. Uh, am I from Briz? Yes, I am from Brisbane. That is where I live. Don't go stalking me now. <laughs> oh no. Yes, I got it. Whew, that was lucky. And yeah, we'll have enough for one more. Alright, let's see if these two dirt up. We're not going to get four. <laughs> four cobble out of this. Eleven people in the stream. Guys, if you are new and you're enjoying it, make sure you click that like button. Yeah. Oh, sugarcane seeds. Yes, that's nice. We wanted those. Uh, since we didn't get them out of a out of the uh, loot bag before, or one of the rewards. So they're going to be good to have. Still, yeah, definitely don't have enough. Nearly night time. We'll sleep through the night here. I wonder how much I can reach from here. We're going to want to light up this area a little bit too here in a, se in a second. And I'm standing on top of this crucible. Probably not the best idea. Or smartest. Eh, can't reach. Alright. Another silkworm. Alright, so, well, now that we've got a surplus of those, let's cook up these eight. So then we've got those. Those give super good saturation, like I was talking about before. Yep, true. Oh, and you should try playing music from Approaching Nirvana and Tobu. They are amazing artists. Yes, Approaching Nirvana is awesome. I have played them on the stream before. And I used to use them for all of my intros in my videos, too. Um, they used to, uh, yeah, be all of the intros. If you go back and look at some old ones from uh, about, like, maybe three or four months ago. And that's old for me. Uh, since I've only been doing YouTube for, like, maybe five, six months. Oh. Alright, we should have enough now, hopefully. I don't, like, for approaching Nirvana, I don't have to, uh, get permission, well, I have to get permission, but they have a, a general statement on their website saying that streamers can use their music and YouTubers give, uh, if you give the correct permissions, uh, the correct, um, what's the word for it? Um, words, I can't come up with them right now. Yeah, they, they, Project Nirvana are fine. Not sure about Tobu. Yeah, I'll have to look into it. Getting plenty of seeds out of this, which is good. Starting to run low on saplings, but... Oh, that's because we were... Oh, what is this? A rubber tree seed. Awesome, we need one of those as well. We are getting very lucky, guys. Alright, we should be able to get four cobblestone out of this now. I don't know why I ran back inside. <laughs> so, four of these in here. Now, I think... I was watching someone's video last night. Apparently this takes about eight minutes to fully convert the cobblestone into lava. So uh, I think while we're waiting, let's go and torch the rest of this island up. We'll keep one charcoal on us. Eight cooked silkworms. So when we start, oh, like we just have now. So apparently the saturation on these things are awesome. So we'll just, we'll keep that in mind when we're running around here, lighting this place up. All right, so. We'll turn F7 on, and then we'll start uh, running around here. Um, oh, we'll go back this way. Yeah, the right recognition. That's that's the word I'm looking for. Ah, move this. 
Uh, let's put one here. Should be right. We have plenty of torches. This tune is so good. <laughs> what really, bro? Ape silkworms is a lot. I got 32 in Sky Factory. <laughs> yeah, well, she'll be right. We'll uh, we'll get plenty at some stage. I'm saying plenty for right now, anyway. Uh, hmm. I don't want to break that block. Can I put this on top? There we go, that'll fix it. I think we're going to get most of the island lit up here. Because zombies and all of that are bad news. Alright, looks like oh, the roof will be unlit now that I think about it. How are we going to get up to there? Well, we just won't go far away from the house, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so... How are we looking here? <laughs> We're only about a quarter of the way through. Alright, well, while we wait, you guessed it, more trees. You know, while we do that, I'll cook up another lot of charcoal as well. And for UHH3, I think they disabled F7 due to Wild not liking it. I actually, I don't know, I remember hearing in a stream once that Wild uh, said it was a bug with one of the mods conflicting something else in the pack, so... I think that's why it doesn't quite work in that, but uh, I might be wrong, so... But yeah, I could see Wild turning it off. <laughs> Although there's another way of getting that information anyway, so I don't know. Whether or not... Uh, Absolutely necessary to turn it off, but oh well. Getting all of these, this string here. This is taking a long time to grow. I need to get the uh, watering can as soon as possible. Once I get this charcoal up and then uh, we get our cobble gen going, then we'll be steaming ahead with uh, getting ourselves some nice stuff. Some cobblestone and some smooth stone, and we'll be really starting to get into it by then. I might have to take a little break here in a second just to get a another glass of water, which is already starting to uh, feel a little used. <laughs> We're only an hour in. Definitely got to get back to used to doing this streaming thing again and talking for an hour. Random question, what do you think about the House of Cards? I have not seen it. Is it the original map? I'm not quite sure what you're asking in regards to the fire. Uh, if you're asking about this map, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is it. And the saturation on that wasn't as good as I thought it would be. I'll just eat another one and see how that goes. That one disappeared before I got a chance to uh, get it. That's alright. Eight of those. Okay, so... Uh, let's make another one. Getting a little bit up in the uh, supplies there, so... Oh, this one. This is what we're looking for. Although, uh, speaking about TV shows, I have been watching Breaking Bad. I've been catching that up last little bit now. That is an awesome show. I finished season one like a week ago. I only just started season two last night now that I'm on holidays. Oh, that first episode of season two is hectic and I've just I've heard that it just gets even more and more just hectic throughout the season and into the next seasons as well. So I'm really looking forward to just sitting down and just binge watching a whole heap of that. Oh, that's good. How about Game of Thrones? You've seen that? Surely you have. Yes. I'm a huge Game of, Thro Game of Thrones fans. Fan? Fans? Yeah. Yeah, I'm definitely up to date with that. That last episode of that season was hectic. Although, I don't want to talk about it in uh, the chat here too much, just in case uh, spoilers and people haven't watched it yet. So, uh, just keep that in mind. 
Have I been watching SpongeBob SquarePants Kappa? No, I haven't been keeping up, sorry. <laughs> Although it is a good show. Breaking Bad is great, yeah. Alright, how are we looking? 260 left. Alright, so I guess we should get our stuff ready here to make a cobble gen. I need to finish season one. You smashed down like four seasons in two weeks. Yeah, I don't know, it's hard to find time. Like, especially with the uh, exams and all that, and then uh, doing all of the streaming and stuff. You end up using a lot of the time of your day to uh, do that sort of stuff. I think we try and make a cobble gen here. What do you guys reckon? So, I'm thinking we're going to try and stand here. Actually, is this going to be to the void? Yes, it is. Alright. Well, actually... I think what we can do, we'll stand on this block here, and this one will be the cobblestone. So, for that to work... Um, let me just lay this out in my head a little bit here. So this block here will be the lava. We're gonna need... Put that there. So this will be the water then. Although we're gonna need to use the water to... Uh, uh, now this isn't going to work as well as I uh, had it before. Whalefish doesn't work. <laughs> really? I thought that was an emote that you can just use in any chat. Personal question, feel free not to answer, but uh, what are you going to school for? I am going to school to uh, study mechanical and aerospace engineering. That is uh, my major. Ooh, that's fine. Alright, so this one's going to get dug out. And so is that one. So this is going to be risky, so let's put everything away that we don't want to lose. Actually, we'll put... We'll make another chest for this. Because we could... this could be the first death coming up here. Oh, we're also going to want to move that plank so it doesn't light on fire. Death number one could be on its way, guys. Alright, where's our water? Fancy. Good luck. Thanks, mate. I've already got only got like another year to go, so. Apparently we're backing up the server again. So, actually this is gonna be sitting here when we're doing it. Um, so what blocks are we gonna use to do this now? Um, 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 um. So I don't want to do it out of wood or sand. Might have to make some cobble again really quickly here. Sixteen, perfect. And it's about night time. Back in 10 to 15, unknown. Alright. G'day, Melbourne. What's going on, bro? Dude, the graphics were looking sick. You even got to test out the donator button and the notification for that. I was so hyped. I was so happy. First donation ever. Alright, let's sleep through the night before anything spawns, even though it shouldn't. So this is done too, so our cobble gen is nearly there guys. Um, also what am I... Ooh, I'll have to turn that into cobblestone too, now that I think about it. Really? How much? Just five bucks? I really need to, uh... Even, I say just five bucks, so that's like... That's huge for like a first donation for me. I really need to add something like on the stream, like up the top there. It's like... Latest donator or top donator or anything like that. Maybe when you do up my, uh... Le Legend, who was the first one ever? It was Unknown Aussie. Ever play any tabletop role-playing games? Uh, things like Dungeons and Dragons? No, I never really got into that when I was at school. I was too busy. I was very into sport at school. I was. Uh, I played a lot of basketball at a, a somewhat high level. Um, you know what? We can just use this clay. What am I talking about? I can just dig this clay up and use it. Even though I'm just wrecking the island, who cares? 
Yeah, but like I was saying, uh, Melman, or Ryan, whatever, um, next time you update the uh, graphics for the stream overlay, you can add something like that in, I guess. Um, Alright, so this is going to be interesting. <laughs> so, let's... Uh, so this is going to go here. Uh, 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 we're going to make it out? Yes, we are. Look at that. Pro skills right there. And then this will go here. And then we'll have another one on the other side. Man, this music is chill. And I don't think it's going to sneak out there. No. Should be fine. Awesome. So let's trade this block here. At least we didn't die there. That's a good thing. Let's move this over here. Just trying to make everything so that uh, we're going to lose this to the void now too. Dang it! We got any more? Yes, we do. Just trying to preserve our hunger here a little bit. Definitely look into it, eh? Yeah, man. All right, so that one's going to be. Void. This one here will be void. Oh no, got it back. Awesome. So then I just had to be careful not to actually. Yes, I can't walk off there. So that's good. All right, so we can pretty much get this started. So this will be water, and then we'll get our cobblestone or oh, our lava. What am I talking about? <laughs> Look it up. Thanks for the recommendation. Hadn't heard of that one. Lava in the bucket. Please work. Yeah, Cobble Jam. There we go. Assuming that's the name of the board game and I'm not just reading your comment wrong. Um, Munchkin. Yeah, I haven't heard it either of those. Currently harvestable, apparently. <laughs> really need to make this one block lower. Hopefully we'll level this pick up, pickaxe up soon too by doing this, but this is going to be the boring part of the stream, I'd imagine. I'd imagine. Oh, did that not... Uh, did that block your link then? I'm not sure. I didn't delete it on mine. Wow, this is going to take a long time. <laughs> Oh, we're getting unlucky in terms of the, get the water pushing it into the uh, lava. Yeah, it blocked it. Oh, I can see. It. I can see it as well. I think that's because we're mods, though. Yeah, let me see if I can do something about that. Uh, try again. You might be able to post it this time. Alright. Well, now that we've got plenty of cobblestone, let's cover that up a little bit here, just in case. I don't want to go just walking into that randomly. By accident. <laughs> that wouldn't be good. Oops. Cobble for days. Yeah, I probably should make this one block lower now that I think about it. Yo, what's going on, Cats Domic? Cats Domite? Cats Doe MC? My bad. <laughs> I butchered that pretty badly. Welcome to the stream, mate. How's the Overpock? Uh, Overwatch Epoch download going? Uh, I've been trying it. It's been er making errors like the last couple of times I've tried to do it. I've been doing it a couple of times uh, here this week trying to get it, um, get it going, but uh, yeah, I haven't been successful just yet. I'll definitely try and work on that. I definitely think we'll stream it too at some stage. How's this pick going? We're nearly out. I want to try the other pick and see what it's like. I think it's a bit quicker. Um, mining speed 1.92. Mining speed 4. Wow, this one is so much quicker. 
Although you have to repair it with uh, Netherrack, so it'll be one time use for us now. Probably going to change your name to Block Climber. Fair enough. Oh, this is so much quicker. Buy anything in the Steam sale lately? No, I haven't bought anything yet, which is crazy. I haven't checked today's deals just yet. Hashtag IGN, what? <laughs> um, not quite sure what you mean by in-game name. Oh, I need to eat again. Definitely need to get a farm going here soon. <laughs> it's all good, cat's dough. Ah, oh, now it's capitalized so I can actually see it properly. Oh, IGN for the win. <laughs> it's all good. So, if there is anyone new in the stream and you're enjoying it so far, make sure you click that follow button. You'll get a nice little notification pop up over there. There. <laughs> that was designed by the, uh, the very talented Melman. You can check his stuff out. I've got his link for all of his stuff on Facebook. Down below in the info section of the stream. How much cobblestone have we got now? Getting pretty close. What's the pan? It is the pan of destiny. Uh, it's one of the rewards. And you can use it to cook stuff up. I'll show you guys soon. Anyway, it's about time we turn in a few more quests too. Rather than just jetting a cobble here. Igneous Extruder is going to be the money here soon. I think we're going to try and get to that soon. Didn't think the deals were so hot today. Blackguard seems kind of cool, but I, you like RPGs. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't play many RPGs. Alright, stack of cobble. Let's see where we're at. Let's get our other pickaxe out. That one can be our one to uh, cobble gen. Angelic and Divine Pans for the win. <laughs> so this pan, if we take this out and put this on the ground, you can shift right click it on the ground and you can cook food in it, which is pretty cool. And then uh, you just pick it back up again and then it's like a... got pretty good attack damage. It's got two and a half hearts, which is alright. How do you go back to the first page of the quest book? Right click. So we go and get our quest book here just to see where we're at. Uh, if, you, if you're on a page, you just right click and it um, goes backwards. Alright, so, yeah, what happened to... Oh, it's right there, don't worry. Fishing trip. How the... How am I supposed to get a fish? Hmm. Looks like we're gonna have to go fishing soon. <laughs> um, Alright, dust in the wind. Placing four broken ores, so we're gonna have to do a fair bit of sifting and stuff soon. We might do that now. But, uh, let's just get some smooth stone going here. I dare say we'll need it before long. The pan is amazing, that pan for the win. <laughs> yeah, that pan is pretty cool. Why can't I? Oh. <clears throat> Alright. Grab a drink of water here. I can already feel the throat. It's starting to get a <laughs> bit used. Okay. Everything for the win. <laughs> hashtag, hashtag. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, so what are we doing? I get sidetracked very quickly. I'm gonna do dust in the wind, so we need to get some ore gravel. So that means we're gonna need to sift ourselves some gravel itself, so let's get our hammer out. Start hammering all of this. Then we're gonna sift it all. I don't know how much gravel we're gonna need, otherwise uh, we could be here a while doing this. <laughs> Bricks are the most angelic and divine things in the universe. Screw towels. Interesting. Fair enough, fair enough. Alright, what did we get out of that? Three lead, two aluminum, or aluminium, depending on where you're from. No iron, that's weird. Oops, about time to go to bed. 
Bricks are more useful than towers. Well, that's probably true. Our carrot's nearly grown. Oh, we'll be able to make ourselves our, um... We'll be able to get some food here soon, because we'll be able to make ourselves a... Um... Oh, uh, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy? Oh, I haven't seen that movie. <laughs> or read the book. For that matter. Uh, but yeah, we got to get our watering can here soon now, when the, uh... Stone cooks up. I think we were all a little bit lost there for a second. What have we got? A bit of amber. Alright, so... I think that's gonna work for the quest. Oh, we need iron or gravel. Put in gravel, sand and dust through sieves. So we gotta get iron? Wow, that's gonna be really painful, seeing as we're not getting any iron here. <laughs> oh well. Well, one way of doing it is you could just sit at the cobble generator and do it like this. Get gravel this way. You've had to get an inf <laughs> into an argument on how I can't drive myself with bricks. <laughs> but you can in a brick oven. Well, that's that's some logical thinking. Although... Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> then you, you need more than just bricks for a brick oven, I guess. Man, the chat has just gone on a completely random tangent right now. <laughs> Could hurt. Just gotta make sure it doesn't get too hot. I guess. Still haven't dropped any frames, which is good. Our internet is surviving today. Did you just stop the water from going all the way to the bottom of the void? Why's that? Now let me, really quickly here, let's try something here really quickly. Alright, so I want to, this is going to be interesting. Um, 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 um. <laughs> I'm trying to, uh, I want to place this block a little bit underneath, but I can't sneak into here now. Um, how am I going to do this? I'll, blo I'll break this block. This will be fine. Put that away. Put all oh man, I'm running out of inventory. Stuff it. We'll do it live. Agree with the sentiment, but I mean nothing we can do about it, sadly. <laughs> Alright. No, I missed. And I'm out of... Oh, that's alright. We'll just put this here. And that one there. Alright. Come on, I need to be up before I run out of breath. We'll get there, we'll get there. Oh, clutch. We clutched that, guys. <laughs> clutch mode. Alright, so now this should work a bit better. Where do we put our pick? Uh, we need to break that one. Need to break this one. And we're out of pick. Oh, now I need to be careful. Um, yes, there. Yeah, I think that should be working again. So let's repair our pickaxe. You had a dream of being a pan, but then I became a brick pan. Mm, okay, I think that's enough uh, chat about bricks for now. Oh, Look at that, brand new. So this should work a little bit better. Break this one. Yes, this will work a lot better. So I can stand here for days and just... Ah, this will work a lot better now that I'm a lot closer. You know, I haven't had any dreams lately. That's a good question, Snoresby. What, what was the last dream I remember? Um... What was the last dream I remember? I don't know. It's been a, it must have been a fair while since I've had one. <laughs> no more bricks, I is sad. Well, can't talk about bricks all day. We got a little bit more gravel here. We'll get half a stack and then we'll go sift it all and see if we can get lucky. Unknown Aussie, did you miss anything? Um, 
We've got a cobble gin going. I don't know whether you're here for that. So we're getting some gravel at the moment. One more piece and we should be good to go. Alright, let's uh, go sift all this. Oh man, I forgot to... Here we go, this is solution. So let's see if we can get some iron out of this. Sonsby, do I have my own server? No, I don't have a server at the moment. I haven't had the chance to. Uh, I think we'll do, for maybe like a thousand subscribers on YouTube or something, we'll do like a... Uh, a day where I'll say, look, I'm going to be playing on this server. We'll play some vanilla or something. We might play some prison or something like that. Whatever's popular at the time. And uh, I'll give you guys all of the IP. And you can come play with us. So that should be a bit of fun. And I'll live stream it all as well, so. Mmm, <laughs> that early grant. Early game grind. Wow, this is taking a lot longer than what it used to. I wonder if my mouse spam works still. Uh, no one here as good as it used to. <laughs> I used to have a macro, like, because um, I use Razor stuff. Oh, my, my viewer clip count just disappeared off my screen. <laughs> um, yeah, I used to have a macro that I could run and it would just spam, uh, spam right-click on my mouse. It doesn't quite work how it used to anymore. There is a donate button. It is down below. Definitely don't have to use it, though. See, imagine doing this without the cobble generator. That's what I went through. Oof, that's rough. If you scroll down, you'll find it. Yeah. Grinding gravel is early game grind. Oh my gosh. I didn't even think about it that way. <laughs> Aluminum. Iron. Yay. Alright, so now we got the iron ore gravel. Quest book. So we got that. So ore sand. So now we need the iron ore sand, which is pretty straightforward now that we've got the gravel. What else did we get? Quick silver drops. Interesting. We even got a shiny. Which is nice. Ore. So you can do that and you get at least four of the crushed to get the iron or sand. Don't tell me you need all of them. I oh don't know, that works. And then the dust, do exactly the same thing again. Put that in your crafting grid and you got iron or dust. <laughs> nice try, thigh moment. <laughs> I'm on mobile. Unlucky. Alright, so then we should probably... Is that the end of that quest? Ooh, which bag, guys? You guys can pick. You've got one minute to pick which bag I should pick here. Fair enough, MC dude. <sighs> Let me see in the chat. Middle, left, or right? Not that it will make much of a difference. While I'm waiting, I'm going to make myself that... Um, watering can. GG Thy Thelman. <laughs> GG. I'm still getting used to that new username, dude. It's so weird. So different from your old one. Suits you, though. One, 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 two, three. Right, middle. Oh, wow. This is not. <laughs> this is spammy as. Okay, so we got. GG, well played. <laughs> one for middle. I think one. <laughs> Spy word six. Looks like from the chat the general consensus is the first bag. Let's finish uh, this real quick. Like so, and then you put this in the top. Empty watering can. Awesome. Ah! Whoops, I forgot that I had those in there. Where's the silkworms gone? Did I throw them off the edge then? Alright, bag time. Bag one. Middle. Claim reward. Right, what did we get? Oh, it's a good bag. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Um, more of a decor reward. 0.99% chance to get this reward. Four of the amaranth trapdoors. 
Do the first bag and you shall get a cookie. <laughs> Alright, well, what do these look like? Are they just trapdoors? Eh, well. You shall get another mom? Right, I don't quite understand that. Alright, so, well, I need another chest in here to put all these ores in. Let's create one of those real quick. I wonder what quest we've got left now. We should be getting pretty close to being able to make ourselves a smeltery, I think. Uh, nope, not that one. <laughs> I wanted a chest. Cookie to you. Lame. C6 was the better option. Yes, it definitely was. Six was the money. Just didn't quite take your advice, and now I'm paying for it. <laughs> At least we're getting plenty of ore and stuff now, so that's good. Sleep through the night. So, we'll look at our quest book and see where we're at now. I haven't seen that follower notification off. Everyone must be staying in the stream for a long time and not coming in and out. Oh, now we've got the water. Water in can. Let's actually get these carrots going. Should have filled it up back in the house. This will do that. We'll come up to this water source. So you guys can see the other part of the map. Should be full now. Yep. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Alright, so let's uh, rain down on this. I have to get a little farm going here soon too. There we go, look at that. Ah, all the carrots. How do you get carrot seeds? Was that... Oh no, did I just waste that then? Watering can is OP. <laughs> Should have picked one nine one six and a half plus. Oh my god. <laughs> well, it looks like we're not making any more of those. I've got another piece of dirt. Yes, we do. Let's put down. Wonder if pumpkins are any good. Actually. Ghetto farm. <laughs> I think it's balanced really well, to be honest, cats. Yeah, no, it does take a little bit to get it, but then you got to spend the time there uh, getting it as well. All right, let's get a little farm. Where is my hoe? There it is. Get these seeds going. I think I should have right-clicked it. Plant the carrot. Oh, can you? Oh, that's right. You can just plant them straight, can't you? Oop. I can't believe I... General vanilla mechanics, I'm just derping. It has infinite water. Well, that is true, but... Machines don't work so well because they break... I remember I like exploited that so bad back in the Resident Rise days. And so many farms where I just ran it straight off um, the watering can. <laughs> I want to get another set of these going. I wonder if you can compost carrots. We might just sit here for a bit and get some. But I think we'll be able to uh, fill our hunger back up here soon. So you can right click these too and then uh, it pops the plants off. So, Am I using Faithful? I am indeed using Faithful. 13 viewers in the stream, guys. If you're new and you're enjoying it and you haven't already done so, you can click that follow button. You'll get a, a cool notification pop up by T Notifier. Glad I got that thing installed. It's really rad. <laughs> um, and you'll look at. Uh, hey, Snorzy, when you get the chance, make a juicer. It will make your carrots last longer. Yes, that is exactly what I was going to do next. Now that I've got a heap of carrots. So at least we shouldn't be uh, too worried about food for the next little bit anyway. Best texture pack in your opinion? Yes, I would have to agree as well. It doesn't stray too far away from the vanilla textures, and it just looks a little bit nicer. Although, when I play vanilla, I like using R3D Craft. I remember that pack was uh, very nice to look at. But uh, in terms of modded, I like this one the best. Plenty of carrots. We'll get to a stack here and then we'll make ourselves a juicer and call it a day for that. And then we'll look in our quest log and see what we've got next. 
Gardening, gardening Simulator 2014, here we are, right now. Sortex Fanver is pretty nice too, though it gets away from the vanilla look, yes it does. Like, if you're going to go for one that um, looks a little bit different, I don't know whether you just go the full, full shabam. So yeah, that does look nice. Probably spelled that wrong by the way, Sortex Fanver, I think you got pretty close. You should make a huge carrot factory that produces thousands of carrots per second. <laughs> Maybe one day. Although, I think um, we'll eventually get to the point where we'll be making um, some sort of automated system to make like big meals and stuff. Because if you look at the recipes you can use this in, you can like make carrot cake and glazed carrots with butter and sugar and all this good stuff. See, it's like a light meal. It's all about how, like, the saturation and all that works. Yeah, Spy, that's your other favourite? Yeah. Alright, there we go. So, yeah, let's see if you can... Oh, you can put these in. you got to put a lot in, though. <laughs> a lot in. Wow. That was, like, 16 of them. That one day is today. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead and get our juicer going. So to make a juicer, get a pressure plate and one of those, I think it's in the middle maybe? Yes. And then you can turn these carrots, which are, I don't know what you call them. You can call them into, put them into carrot juice and that's like an unfulfilling snack. So that does a full, oops, a full lamb chop, I think. Yes, it does. Don't know what the saturation is like, but uh, we've got that many of them, so. I'm not even worried. So for the first time since we started today, we're back to full hunger. Thank God. Alright. So, let's look at the quest log. I think the only one's left here. Oh, that one's completed. Oh, did I not? I didn't claim a reward. Alright, another bag. Pick in the chat right now which bag. One, two, three, or four. We'll see how we go. I'll give you another minute to do so. While we're waiting for that. Hmm, how do we get about seared stuff in this? So we can get sand, we can get we can get everything. We just need more. Oh, you know what I can do? We need to get ourselves some shears. Iron is the only one you can do that with, isn't it? I might just get some more gravel. Five. Look, look at your potion effect after you eat the carrot stuff. Yes, it gives you well fed. Which, uh, is just a little buff. I'm seeing four. There's already three fours. And if any of you guys have watched uh, Death Ridge Craft, we've got Baseline Chicken going right now. <laughs> Death Ridge is a funny fella. I'm seeing four. Looks like we're going to go fourth bag if no one else is going to... Alright, bag number four it is, unless my chat is just really slow for some reason. <laughs> Alright. Bag number four. Claim reward. What do we get? It's a good one again. You guys are picking the good ones. Baseline chicken. <laughs> oh, a useful reward. A titanium fishing rod. That sounds like it's, like it's a good one. I don't know what you'd use it with. <laughs> um, shift to display. You need to bait it with worms, with bee bait, or raw minnow. Hmm, interesting. Definitely going get to get to using that at some stage, I guess. Baseline chicken. Oh, it's a thing in uh, Death Ridge Craft's live stream. He, um, whenever he this song comes on, he, he calls it Baseline Chicken. The name of the song is actually called Baseline Kicking, but yeah, that's just a thing that they do in their stream. Pretty entertaining. Alright, how much, uh, we need to make ourselves another hammer here. And we'll gather a bit more of that. At least we'll be able to make ourselves a stone one now. Wait, I thought I just ran out of that one. Oh well. You can fish in the void? As in, like, you just throw it off the side and it'll... It doesn't make much sense. This is on last year ability. 
with the fishing pole. <laughs> right, so I'll just throw it out into the void and see if it'll... Alright. Ah, this is so much quicker. How long have we been going for now? Probably, I think we're just over an hour and a half in. <laughs> Don't think that's right, but maybe, lol. <laughs> Ah, this is so much quicker. Getting all the gravel. So we'll get ourselves some shears and then we'll be able to make heaps of dirt. So we can get heaps of clay and... Ah, good times to come. Totally right, no sarcasm at all. <laughs> Alright. Back to this. We need to automate this at some stage, but we definitely don't have enough uh, materials just at the moment. As a wise man once said, YOLO. Well, he did say it once, and then it got totally taken out of context, but fair enough. <laughs> oh, this gravel is taking so long. <laughs> And I'm nearly out of water. I'll probably take a break here in five minutes. Also, what uh, I know that when you have to fish for one of the quests, you need to right-click into the air so that the fish catchy part doesn't get stuck on the ground. Yeah, uh, when I think what you do is you go stand up in the um, in that pond up the top, and then you just look straight up in the air and cast it, and it'll land in the, in the water. You're totally a fisherman, fish catchy part. <laughs> Hopefully we're getting some good loot out of this, and I think it's become night time. Yes, let's sleep real quick before, uh, before any mobs spawn on the roof. You think dirt and cobble could totally make an automatic sieve machine? <laughs> I think you're getting a bit ambitious there. Hopefully we're going to get enough iron out of this. What have we got? Let's put all this away. Oh, plenty. Look at that. I'll even be able to hammer it and maybe get a bit more. Let's see. Oh, we're getting close. Over time we'll get more. Everything is possible. Oh, let's smelt this up. Um, for now, we won't waste our charcoal. Um, I think that's what we need. Yes. <laughs> but then we get some shears, and then how much bone meal have we got left? We got heaps. Not even worried, bro. Not even worried. Okay, so let's get some more trees growing here. Oh wow, that cooked silkworm is hard to see. And then we'll need to get ourselves some more crooks, I think. Let's do that. Oh, oh no, I failed that pretty hard then. <laughs> let's clean our inventory up. Too many tools all at once. Um, and that there, and then... Iron. Woo! First bit's iron. The sad truth is that it is. Wait. The sad truth is that it isn't. Some things are really impossible. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that is true. Alright, I think we should be good. So that's. We could probably get up there now, nearly. We get ourselves a bit more cobble. How are we looking in terms of leveling this pick up? Still only 70%. Let's, uh, let's mine some more of this cobble here. I think I'm going to upgrade the, the head of it to a um, cobblestone head, just because it's that slight bit faster. And I'm going to need some more wood for that. I'm just all over the place with doing stuff at the moment. Sorry if I'm just <laughs> going back and forth. This is sort of how I end up playing some of the time. Uh, 
one, that one can go in there. I want a wood one. So this is a neat feature. For, oh. Oh, I wanted to put flint, not... Okay. That'll come in handy later. Um, so then, one of the neat features with the... Uh, dance party. Everyone start dancing, including you, Snoresby. Why would I start dancing? <laughs> so rare. Um, Alright, so one of the neat features from Iguana Tweaks is you can actually upgrade tools by doing it in the tool station somehow. That's no, not a tool station, it's a crafting station. Uh, how do I modify? Oh, there we go. That's no. The main way to repair or change your tools, place a tool and a material on the left to get started. Oh, it has to be fully repaired. That's right. The hell that I remember it. Ah, look at that. Now you can upgrade the speed of it. It's a, uh, a, uh, gravel one. What time does everyone, what time does the end... What time does this... Oh man, wow. My reading skills right now are lacking something chronic. What time does this end East Coast time? I'm not sure. Probably uh, probably two hours from now. So another random question. What kind of music other than the type you're playing on the stream right now do you listen to? Um, I listen to a lot of EDM. It's pretty much the only thing I ever listen to. Uh, sometimes I'll listen to some old school hip-hop from like way back like uh, Biggie Smalls and all that. But really, that's this is all I listen to. Um, I do listen to a lot of other stuff that's not Monster Cat, obviously, because uh, I can't play that on the stream today. But, uh, yeah, this is pretty much it. Start dancing because people will be happy and you'll get cookies. <laughs> get all this cobblestone and we'll pull this big tree down now that we've uh, got the materials to do so. 14 people in the stream. Guys, if you are enjoying what you're watching, make sure you click the like button. And if you're viewing me on Twitch for the first time, I do have a YouTube channel where I do uh, do another stream tomorrow. It is likely. Uh, I dare say I won't be um, streaming Agrarian Skies, but we'll be definitely streaming tomorrow morning, same time, same place. Uh, but yeah, like I was saying, there's Twitter down below, there's YouTube down below. You can go check all that stuff out for more gaming goodness from me. Um, wow, this thing is so much quicker now. So I'll get a little bit more here. Wow, my view account's just going up and down, up and down. Not sure what the guys with that. How are we looking here? Get another, another twenty-four pieces, and then I might take a break really quickly. Welcome to the jungle, oh. bitch! Welcome to the stream, <laughs> new follower, thanks Cats Doc. Cats do MC, thank you very much for following. Do I go to Minecon? I have never been to Minecon. And it's uh, it's always been in a weird place that I, it's hard for me to get to because it's always overseas. The lurk is real. <laughs> so here is yet another question, what is it like tomorrow? I mean, you're from the future technically. Oh, technically, because it is the 25th here. For me, it's probably the 24th. Well. I don't know. It's a good question. <laughs> if if Minecon ever comes to Australia, which is it's likely it might do eventually, or if we get enough uh, uh, enough fundage at some stage, I'm I'm pretty sure once I get finished college or university and I uh, start actually earning some money, I might end up going one day. All right, let's get this tree down. Have to do a lot of jumping here. That's alright though, we've got plenty of food, so you don't have to worry about it as much. So I don't think we'll be short of string anytime soon. <laughs> Aren't you the doctor? Show us your TARDIS. <laughs> no, I am not the doctor. String for days. I don't have to be careful when we get close to going over the edge of the void here. Hopefully I brought enough crooks up with me. Yeah, I got plenty. End of my electric screwdriver. Don't you mean sonic screwdriver? Pretty sure that's what it's called, even though I've never really watched it. The only reason why I think it's called sonic screwdriver is from Red Power 2 back in the day. I think it had a sonic screwdriver. 
You know you saw this video where people compiled the worst of the wor <laughs> worst of the worst from Minecon Paris and it put me off the whole thing. Yeah, that's a some of the like open panel questions are just so. Yeah. New follower, thanks, D Ring two one nine. Thank you so much for following, buddy. Or is it Dring? Not quite sure. <laughs> Either way, thank you very much. Very much appreciated. Hopefully, got enough crooks for all of this. Ah. It, it is called the SS Sonic Screwdriver. Ah, unlucky. It'd be you'd be surrounded with a lot of people half your age. Yeah, that's true. I don't know. I think I'd I'd be on the top end of the. I don't know. A lot of the streamers and YouTubers and stuff go. So maybe if like I end up sort of getting to know a few of them, and there's like a big group of them going, I'd tag along one day. <laughs> that follower notification is so good. So glad I got it. So you didn't follow earlier? Couldn't find the follow button? Mate, that is... That's fair enough. I don't blame it. It's all good. Alright, we're getting somewhere near chopping this whole thing down. Jeez. <laughs> No problem, man. I've been watching you for a while. I just joined this Twitch. This is the first time I haven't been... haven't been kecked from the website. Really? Not quite sure what kecked means. Really great. Made by me to follow... Hang on. It really is great. Made me follow just to see it. <laughs> Otherwise, I probably wouldn't have. Ah, oh, I'm glad I got it then. <laughs> I think the sound uh, does well. And then the sound for the donation one's pretty cool as well. If you are here earlier to catch it, it's pretty cool. Slowly getting there. I think we're nearly there, guys. I think we've got it. Awesome. <laughs> Why are they named Crooks? I don't know. That is a question I can't answer. Look at all that string on the ground. <laughs> at least we got our platform back. Part of the reason why you donated? <laughs> no, I'm very glad you did. I need to add a thing on the screen that says top donator or whatever. Now that I've got that set up. I only got that set up yesterday. Uh, a lot of these new graphics I got set up yesterday as well, so... Alright, how much string? We got so much string out of that. Oh dear, that's crazy. Twitch doesn't like you. It normally just boots me from the website. Not sure if it's a Firefox issue or the internet, but Twitch doesn't like me. Now that I have joined, I might be able to watch streams. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Does this have Vein Miner? I don't think so. Not that I'm aware of, anyway. Probably eat up a bit here. And sleep through the night. Well, we've got 10 more minutes and I'll have a break. I know I said I was going to have a break like 15 minutes ago, but yes. <laughs> <clears throat> no, it's been good, the stream so far. Hopefully a lot of people have been coming across from the YouTube channel. I'd imagine a few of you guys that are here now would have been coming across from there. Alright, now that we've done that, finally, we can, uh, let's, uh, how much cobble? Let's just straight start putting it out here. Closing this platform off a little bit. And we can start putting a whole heap of, uh, things here. Whoops. My mouse has been playing up lately. It double clicks a lot of the time for some reason. It's starting to get a bit annoying, to be completely honest. See, look at that. Especially when you're trying to place blocks all over the place. No, Vein Miner was disabled, won't even work if you add it to the mod list. Oh, wow. Well, that's fair enough. Jaded does tend to do things like that. So, can't blame her though. It's her pack, she can do what she wants. <laughs> Should build a castle? Yeah. There's a lot of fancy blocks in this pack, so I dare say creative building will come into it at some stage. Oops. 
to do this so I can't fall off the edge. All right, is this fall safe? I think so. I'm gonna just tear this down a little bit here. But uh, not sure how you feel about that because it was kind of cheaty. Yeah, Razor Death Adder. No, I have a Razor Imperator uh, from 2012. It's actually it's lasted me a long time. This is the first ever sort of gaming peripheral I've actually bought. Back at the time, it was for my laptop. Well, first gaming peripheral for the PC. I should have reworded that a bit better. Um, let's make some more torches here real quick. Are they sticks? No. I have that much junk in my inventory right now. It's not good. It will come in this stage. Mine is the same problem. Yeah. Gets a tad annoying. Alright, let's uh, put these green bits down here. So I don't fall off the edge. Awesome. Nothing I can fall down there. Good. Alright. I'll make another little ramp here. I've just put stuff down non organized at all at the moment. <laughs> You know this has two parts of the mod, they may give you another shot since the update expire. Alright, let's put all this away. And then... What is in this one? I'm getting emails like crazy on my phone. <laughs> I don't know whether you guys can hear it. I think the issue is with the item IDs, you have to manually enter the tools you want to use. Ah, okay, fair enough. Alright, well, I'm thinking what we're going to do here, because we're going to have a lot of trees coming soon. We're going to make a whole heap of chests. Start putting them up in here. So we can sort of have things a little bit organised. <laughs> so, I'm thinking just blocks in general can go in this chest. Not this song. What's wrong with this song? Um, and then tools in this one. I'm gonna need that though. Things I don't want to lose. Ah, oh, stuff it. All of this can go in. <laughs> Get the book on me though. Alright, let's grow these trees up. What games do I play? I play a whole heap of different stuff. Mainly Minecraft though, and um, oh my god, oh, I thought we got another big tree then. I was gonna be so mad. But I play like few first person shooters play like Counter Strike and I just play anything that I've got really on in general. Oh, you've heard this song way too many times. Alright, I'll skip it then. I've heard this song a lot too, but I like it, so I'm gonna play this one. Tough tamales. Oh wait, I didn't need to make any crooks because I'm using shears on this one. Oh yeah, yo, yo. So many rookie errors. Look at this. I don't know how long it's gonna last, but uh <laughs> now that we've got a uh, a good source for uh Iron and stuff. I'm not too worried. Look at that. Oh, and you get saplings dropping from it too. Oh, that's good. You like a lot of uh Put on some fish dubstep. Call it blood step. Blood step. Blub step. I'm not quite sure what that is. I can't quite uh, just play any music because I am putting this on YouTube. I've got to put music that won't get me uh, flagged on there. So at the moment, that's this is uh. Only stuff I can really listen to. Whoops. Yeah, we're gonna go through this uh, <laughs> these shears pretty quickly. It's all right. We got plenty of other materials. So I think I've had a pretty good start so far today, guys. You like a lot of RPG games, but also strategy games are cool. Like a ton of different genres, personally. Yeah, I do play a fair bit of random, just other stuff from time to time. Not really strictly creative or anything like that. Crusader Kings 2 is a great game, especially if you're a fan of history. I've heard that is what the case is, but I'm not a huge history buff or anything like that, so I probably wouldn't find it too interesting, to be honest. Blub Step will not get you flagged, just act like a fish was... Saying wub wub wub. Right. And they have a fantastic song of Ice and Fire mod. Oh, that'd be sick. <laughs> that'd be cool. 
This will probably be the last tree we get any use out of this shears for. At least we're getting plenty of uh, leaves though, so that's good. Oh, 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 can't reach, there we go. Alright, how are we looking here? Plenty of stacks. So, let's get our barrels here. I'll end up making like another five of these things. Whoops. Um, a little bit more. Have I hit? Have I looted the dirt uh, hidden chest? Yes, I have. That was probably the first thing I did. I think. Ah, there we go. That's got it. So let's place all these down. You also picked up this Space Empire game. That is pretty great. Focus also shipbuilding, so you have to make your own units, and it's like an RTS, but it's also sort of like Civilization. Oh, that's pretty interesting. I've played Space Engineers. I don't know whether you guys have picked that up and played that yet. I did a series on YouTube on it too. Pretty fun. If you guys are looking for a game similar to Minecraft, but in space. It's a great game. You made the mistake of waiting too long to invest in the combat tech trees, though, so your military got screwed. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Right, plenty of leaves. That's good. And some apples. <laughs> Alright, what is the time? I think I'm going to take a little break, guys. Probably like three minutes or so. Um, don't go anywhere, though, because when we get back, we're going to keep grinding on these quests. Uh, for those on the YouTube channel, hopefully you enjoyed this first half. I think I'll probably upload two hours at a time here. And uh, you guys can watch that. So, I am going to be two minutes, guys. Don't go anywhere, because when we get back, we will keep grinding these quests out. And uh, yeah, if you haven't followed already, make sure you click that follow button if you're going to head out while I am heading out as well. <laughs> Don't leave us. It'll be for like two minutes, cats do. Thanks for stopping by if you are going to leave, though. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in just a moment. Don't go anywhere. I will be right back.